welcome back so i'll be showing you guys what you should be doing right now in the fourth of july promo but before i do make sure you guys drop a like down below and as well as subscribe to the channel with your post notifications on and without further ado let me get straight into it we got a bunch of new players like michael strahan jordan poyer Larry Fitzgerald, tim tebow ryan jazir and even a madden max christian mccaffrey now let's get into it first of all we have a journey you guys got to grind throughout this journey it will give you the fourth of july tokens and even chances at uncommons, rares, and epics. Different overall stages will get you, you know, different chances at players. Like the lower one will give you an uncommon and even program stamina, which is nice. And when you keep on climbing, you'll get more program stamina, more of that player. And then the rarity goes up. You get two rares, you get more stamina. Over here, higher 6,000, you get two rares, more stamina. A chance at epic, and then at 7,000, you even get. An epic chance at an iconic and then more stamina so if you even have to use boost at the end if you're not that high you can do so the rewards are actually pretty nice and will help you a ton throughout the fourth of july promo so make sure you grind everything all the journey make sure you're on top of that because it will help you a ton to get a head start throughout the promo now with this definitely grind the journey i wouldn't you know auto i would play each event once until you complete it all and if you can't complete it all then you just go back and auto because maybe your overall doesn't hit that high so that's okay but just make sure you're on top of that and grinding for fourth of july tokens and every sort of the players that are given now with this we got a prize board and the rewards are you know pretty nice we got a fourth of july premium logo which it's a 9% chance. We also got 9% chance at uncommons, uh, 4th of July uniform, uh, rares, a nameplate, tokens, more rares, uncommons, all that stuff. So I'm pretty sure you just click on this and then claim it. And it just, oh, this is cool. We never had this before. So this is actually cool. Dang, I was so close to that logo. Oh, and it gives fireworks at it. Okay, I'll take a, I'll take a rare. Hey, this is probably the coolest thing we have ever seen for a reward system in Madden Mobile so far. That, that was actually nice. I will take that. That was cool. You get a ticket, I'm pretty sure, by logging in every single day. So when you log in, you get a ticket. You get to spin the prize board, which you should be doing, you know, right now when you log on. And uh, yeah, you get just a random reward which is cool. So I was just looking around the journey and you can actually get more tickets throughout the green events. So there is a ticket right here. And then every single green little, you know, player event thing, you get a ticket, which is actually a lot better than what I thought, because in the goal, it said right here, log in during the 4th of July program and get a ticket. So I thought like every day you get a ticket, maybe you still do. But every single one of these green little events give you a ticket, as you can see. This last one doesn't. Gives you a firework and a ticket. Well, no, it actually does. It gives you a ticket too. But it gives you a firework, ticket, uniform, all that. But you got to be a 7,000 plus overall to do that. And I didn't mean to click on albums. I want, oh wait, do I have to click? Uh, yeah, I have to click on albums to go to... The 4th of July players that we have. So as you saw, we got Larry Fitzgerald in the beginning. We got Tim Tebow. We have even Kendall Fuller. Uh, McGrady. Honestly, I love the card art to this promo. We got Jeffrey Simmons. I should have the here in the beginning. Boston Scott. Jordan Poyer. Who else we got? Trey Smith. We got Michael Strahan. Josh Allen. Okay, honestly, how many players we got? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 Iconics in the beginning. If you get 21 players, you can get this 4th of July logo. And if you get 14 players, you can get this 4th of July nameplate. Now there's another nameplate and logo in the prize board that you can spin and get, which you have to get really lucky at that. But every day you have a chance to hopefully do so, which is pretty cool. So, you know. Once you claim something out of the prize board, it will be claimed and you can then go ahead and, you know, get something else by random. 
I think it's two weeks long. Yes, yeah, so you should be able to get everything out of the prize board, most likely. I think it's up there. I think this ends July 11th. So, yeah. Well, that's going to do it for this one. I hope you guys did enjoy. That was the 4th of July promo. Make sure you're grinding the journey. Make sure you claim your prize board reward. And uh, there is fireworks. And I'll be making a video about that soon. It's very hidden, like, with fireworks. And I don't know why there's no, like, firework thing in the corner. But maybe when you claim your first firework, it shows you it. I'm not sure yet. Unless it's just something different. I don't know. I have no clue. But you find fireworks around Madam Mobile in some sort of ways. The first one you can find is in the store. So make sure you claim that. But that's going to do it for this one. I hope you guys did enjoy. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.